Sometimes it just isn't your day. We all need a little help from time to time. That's why we're committed to providing safe, quick, and cost-effective care. And we keep it simple. Just walk in. We're here for you. Learn more today. New York Athletics, it's Kenesha St. Joe's. It's the Marauders, 14 to 13 over Kenesha. I am joined right now by newly inducted St. Joe's Hall of Famer, Naaman Roosevelt, a uh, legendary player here at St. Joe's. Uh, Naaman, uh, what does it mean, we'll start with this, to be inducted into the St. Joe's Hall of Fame? I mean, it was a blessing. I mean, just to walk around the campus and see the new stadium and see the new field. I mean, this is awesome. So it was definitely, man, I, I appreciate everything they did for me. They made me love the game. You know, I came here and I love football. So, and, and I've been able to pursue it for a long time. So I'm excited and it was fun last night. All right, tell us where you are right now. I know you played for a while in for Saskatchewan in the CFL. Mm -hmm. What is Naaman Roosevelt doing right now? So right now I'm just training. I'm helping out, also helping out at uh, Hilbert College, just helping the young guys out there. But I want to get into college football. So that's my main goal right now is to get into college football. Um, I did a little coaching and in Canada this past year, just helping out up there, just learning, you know, the, the ins and outs of coaching. Man, coaching is tough, though. I, I ain't going to lie. I, I thought being a player was tough, but coaching is ten times harder. There's a lot more work. So I'm excited to, to really get on that on that side of the, uh, of the game and just teach kids how to, you know, how to play the game. I know sometimes you've been back in Western New York, sometimes you're Western New York. So mm -hmm. how, where are you living right now? How often do you get to come here? So, so I usually sometimes I'll be back and forth when the, uh, during the off seasons when I'm up in Canada. But now I just moved back here, so I'm staying by UB North, and uh, so I've been over there training at uh, just at UB helping the receivers out, and just a, I got a bunch of guys that you know that go to St. Joe's and go to St. Francis, and a couple of Canadian guys I trained also. So I'm just trying to you know just spread that knowledge that I learned you know these past these past years, and you know I'm excited for what I've been seeing. I mean St. Joe's has been doing awesome, man, and you know I know I already know Canadians had a good team, but I'm, it's good to see that uh, St. Joe's also is. Uh, you know, came ready to play today. You were in this rivalry. You told me that you never lost to Canisius yeah, in your time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, so what is this, for someone who played in it, tell yeah. me what this rivalry is like. I mean, it's awesome. I mean, it's one of the, the whole week is just, you know, you got the pet rallies, you got people talking, you got the fans that come back around, you got the old alumni that come, and it's just all week it's like, all right, no matter what happens, you beat that team. You know, you beat Canisius, no matter what happens, you beat them. So we, uh, so every, all week is exciting. So I know they've been excited, you know, for the past week, these kids. And, you know, to go out here and, and showcase what they've been doing, it's been awesome. So to be in these games, I mean, it's just always, always, you know, it's going to be a sold-out crowd. It's going to be stacked. So it's come out here and perform and, you know, do your best. All right. I want you – you mentioned you did a little bit of coaching. So I want you to put yourselves in Coach Corona's cruise right, shoes right now. You're up 14-13 to 13 over your rival, a team you haven't beaten yet in a long time since 2019. And – the recent series you've lost to. What is your message to the St. Joe's Marauders right now? Hey, I'm gonna I'm gonna say I'm gonna go have time and say, hey, it's zero zero. We go out here and we play our game. We've been doing a good job of of uh, driving the ball and playing good defense. So keep sure keep make sure you can play good defense and also keep driving. Keep keep help keep having long drives, long drives, and keep making plays. And once you get in the red zone, you gotta score touchdowns. That's the thing. Score touchdowns when you get in the red zone. All right, Damon. Uh, just real quick, one player for Joe for each team who has stood out to you so far. For, for Joe's, it's the quarterback, number seven. I mean, he's been doing a great job of, of, of managing the game. He's been uh, running the ball. He's been throwing the ball. He's been, I mean, he's been the team. So when you got a quarterback that can do both, I mean, it's, 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 it's special. And uh, that catch I saw with number three on Kanisha's, man, that was sick. They took it back, but that was, a, that was, a, that was one of them catches, them, them uh, Randy Moss catches where you, uh, you go over somebody's head and catch one of those. But, I mean, they've both been doing a good job. It's been a lot of great plays, a lot of great, uh, you know, a lot of great talent out here. So I'm excited. All right, Naaman, thank you for joining us. Uh, St. Joe's Hall of Famer now, former UB product, Naaman Roosevelt. Actually, you know what, before we end up, I want to ask you, Joe Licata is now at Willingsville yeah, yeah. South. How does that feel? I mean, it's good for Joe, man. I, I'm excited. I went to the first game and checked him out. And, you know, Joe, is uh, he does a great job of calling plays. I mean, i seen him call a, a, a hook and ladder play, and which, which is, you know, Joe is funny with that, man. He makes a lot of plays up, you know, in his head, and he's a great, he's been a, you know, he's a great quarterback, and he was a great quarterback at Buffalo also, so. I mean, he does a great job of what he does, and I'm excited to, uh, you know, see what, how his coaching career goes. All right, that will end it. Naaman, thank you for joining us. The Saint, newly inducted St. Joe's Hall of Famer, Naaman Roosevelt, thank you for joining us at the half. Uh, we'll be right back after the break. It's Joe's Canisius leading, leading Canisius 14-13. to 13. We'll be back in second half action in just a little bit. Thank you. Western New York Immediate Care's new location.